Hello dear partners, my name is Christian Wiesner, your CEO, and today we want to talk about systems, how to market the products directly to the end consumer. And as you know, we invented the system of social club selling, which is incredibly successful till the end of this year. So in our first two years, we opened up 1000 clubs just by the end of 2014. And by the end of 2017, we will have 20,000 clubs all over Europe generating 10 million end customers. So this is of course a crazy success and because we're growing so crazy, some people think and may ask us, is that not an unserious system? Maybe this is like a snowball system or perfect system because this much growth cannot be real. Right? Well, let me tell you exactly what an old pyramid system or snowball system is so people can get this out of their mind because I believe that a lot of people can co get confused just because they don't have the knowledge or the education to really know what is the difference. All right? So first of all, growing as itself is not a problem. Amazon was growing like crazy, Facebook was growing like crazy, and nobody ever would think there is a snowball system. So why do people think this? In the old times, like 1950s and 1960s, there were some companies inventing systems where they actually did not look for end consumer, but they were selling their products to their own distributors. Now let's say you have a, a producer of product and you uh, sell the product to a level one distributor for one euro. Now this distributor will not look for customers as he should, but he will sell this product again for the next distributor for 10 euro. Maybe this is like uh, Europe, the Europe leader, and this is the nation leader, and then you go for a regional leader, and they will sell it within their structure for 100 euro. So the product goes down the structure and gets more and more expensive, and no real end customers will be built up. And of course, the results are clear. Some people will have full garages and no customers. That, of course, is not good. This is, of course, also forbidden all over Europe, and nobody should have. But still some people mischange this because they don't have the proper education to really know what is the difference, right? Now I told you no end customers and product get more and more expensive and it's forbidden. Then you have a pyramid system, all right? But the structure as a pyramid as itself, like it's in the military or in every company, like you have the business owner, the workers and the customers is not forbidden. It's good, it's healthy, it's a stable system. All right, so what we want to have a look now is the traditional way of marketing products. And then you see, of course, the traditional companies, they have huge problems because of the internet and because of direct marketing companies like us, they have huge problems because they have very, very big disadvantages like the old dinosaurs. If you see, you have a product producer here, a hundred years ago, this system was cool. Why? Because you had small shops in every city, so the customers can walk there. They did not have cars to travel long ways. They had no internet to order something online. So they needed to go to small shops around their place. These small shops ordered from big trading companies. And these trading companies ordered from importers, and the importers ordered from the producers. In the old times, that was okay. In the new times, that's totally rubbish because here you produce crazy costs in between making the product at more and more and more expensive and people don't want to have more expensive, they want to have more cheap. All right, so this is very, very crazy. And also, you needed to promote your product with a lot of expenses for advertising to the end customer via TV advertising or normal advertising or branding. So you need to convince your customer through the media that you have a superior product so he knows in the shop in which shelf he should take the product which is the best brand. Now if you see all this system, e even for those companies, it's a very high risk because they have to order the product and they can't give them back. So if you sell food or you sell fashion or whatever you sell and this product doesn't sell, you sitting on a lot of overheads on a lot of uh, uh, costs that you can't make into money. So it's very high risk, all right? And of course, you have a lot of uh, additionally uh, added costs like uh, product warehouses, you have people working for you, all right? So that means very, very small profit, but very high risk. And that is why most companies now change their tactic. They all change to direct marketing, all of them. The whole internet system is a direct marketing system where they try to go to the customer directly. Now what we do very simply, what is social club selling? In social club selling, we have 
both. We have the internet and we have the clubs. Because of the clubs, we can invite customers to the clubs to experience the product. An internet can't do this. Amazon can invite nobody, nowhere, and show them how the product works. So we invite customers for a free trial in our beauty style clubs. And in the beauty style clubs, the customer can test the product. And if they love the product, now they can order through the beauty style club at Wellstar. But the important thing is the beauty style club don't have to buy any warehouse. They just fill out the order sheet, as you know, they send the order sheet to Wellstar or order online, and we send the product directly to the customer without the beauty style club having a warehouse, buying the products, or sending the products directly themselves to the customer. So this is a very, very lean way, a very efficient way how to market the products, because now we have the warehouse, the company, all right, and we send out all the products to the customers, so the beauty style clubs can just focus on what they want to do, marketing products, okay? And with no cost, they have no salaries for people that work for them, they have no warehouse, so they have 95% of the costs not that normal companies have. And that, of course, is a huge advantage. So you earn actually on two things as a distributor or as a club owner, you earn on two things. The first one is the commission that you get if you send an order of a end customer to the company. Very simply, you send the order to the company, we send the products to your customers and send you the commission. No financial risk, just profits. And the second way of com um, commission that you earn is if you teach another beauty style club or another distributor to do the same. But again, they don't buy a warehouse, they don't have any superficial products. All they do is they send the order of their customer to company and we send the products directly to the end consumer. So with this system, you don't have any warehouse, Customers orders and pay directly to the company Wellstar, of course, over the ID number of the beauty style club on the distributor that showed them the products. And that means very simply, no risk, no cost, very profitable system. This is the absolute future and more and more companies and people understand this and come to us and want to become a Wellstar beauty style club. We have the best product, we have the best marketing system, and that's why the best magazines in the world the specialized magazines for economic, they understand what is the future. They say the future is social club selling, meaning tens of thousands of small clubs all over Europe presenting the products for free and then let the customer order directly from the company. This is an absolutely perfect system. This is the perfect combination of POS, points of sales and the internet. This is what we do and this is why we have so much growth. So again, not everybody will understand it from the beginning. If you have a new system, you always go through three stages. The first stage is they will smile at you. They will ridicule you. They will not understand your system. They say, oh, that's so new. This will never work. We always did it the old way. We always had normal shops. Now we normally have the internet. What is this? The next step is, of course, they will fight you because you take volume from other people, you take volume from other companies, and they will not like it. We even take volume from the media because we don't do advertising. We don't need advertising. People come to us because of free tests, not because we spend millions with the media. So some people will fight us because they don't like it. Like they fight mobile phones, like they fight microwaves or cars. But in the end, Victor Hugo said, you can't stop an idea, that time has come. Very simple. What that means very simply is, people will love you and they will copy you. And they will envy you because they did not have the idea 20 years ago. Now this will grow because the time has come to build this very big together, we will have, as I just told you, 20,000 clubs and 10 million customers. And I invite you to be a part of this company writing history in economic. Thank you very much, you're Christian Business CEO.